Okay, here's the butt can that uh, that Ryan and Joey are working on. What these are, uh, these are stencils. They've scuffed it all down, and uh, we just marked them. We've centered them all up. We'll be peeling this away, and we'll be ghosting in some pearl. And these will be uh, be a pretty neat effect when we're done with it. I'll try and keep up with them as we do it. Oh, we're pushing the baby. I say we. Malachi's pushing the Falcon. Look at that. I mean, he, he's one of the big old football players we got. He also likes long walks on the beach and the sound of rain on a tin roof. Ladies, I think he's available. I'm not real sure. But uh, look at him pushing that car. And there's Troy. Look at him. He looks like a natural. He looks like, looks like a scene from uh, American Graffiti or something. Oh, you're doing good. Go over that way here. Oh, you gotta turn the wheel the other way. Yeah, there we go. All right, uh, what what they're doing here, this Dodge truck is a three-stage color. Uh, so we, we mixed up some. They're gonna spray this panel here. We had it laying around. That's good. Hang gun up. And we're gonna spray this, we're gonna keep on spraying it until we get it all covered. This is a special three stage, it's actually like a candy. It gets a tinted clear. So we're gonna spray this today and we're gonna compare it to the truck to make sure we got the right color. Because the paint is really expensive. Isn't that right? There we oh, go. Look, I got Joey. He has got that, got that stencil on there. Man, that looks great, Joey. All right, now, <laughs> that old bulldog or Whatever that thing is, uh, what, what is that thing? Is it like a you call it a bulldog, or is it like a Yorkshire Terrier? Or, I don't know. Oh, I'll probably make somebody mad. I call it a Yorkshire Terrier. All right. All right, let's check on check on the ladies. Oh yeah, how many coats we got on there? About five. I, I tell you what, it looks like it's covered now, right? It Look good. Fun. Okay, and now go ahead. Blow that. They're running it. This is waterborne paint, so we're forcing it dry with this this blower because there's no need to turn to, to activate the paint the boot what I'm trying to say is wow there's no need to turn all that apparatus in the corners of the booth on for this and I'm sure somebody's saying well why didn't you just seal it or make it all one color because they had that writing on there what did it say on it yeah. Twitch. well we did it on purpose that way we know when we got it covered if we did if, let's say we sprayed that gray sealer or dark, dark, dark gray sealer. We really wouldn't know if we had it covered. But where it had those white letters on there, we'd be able to look down in there. And if it's covered, that, so that's why we did it. They call it spraying the hide. I just use that because we already had it. Good job. Well, Haven ends up being the, uh, sorry, didn't mean to scare you, the Lone Ranger today. She's going around taping up, taping up the, uh, the moldings and stuff on this cat so that when she sands it, it doesn't get scratched. All right, I'm not sure I introduced this project, project or not, but a little Toyota. We got a Mateo fixing a dent. There was a rather large dent on the front of the door. He's doing good. I got Ethan. You see the clear was uh, delaminating. He's doing a little more delaminating up there. I don't think we're going to paint this side of the car. It's got a few things, but the paint's in good shape. So, we're working on that. We pulled the hood on. And we got Jonathan's typical Toyota. It has all these, like, chip areas in it. I don't really know what to deal with. Somebody can put in some comments. I don't know, but there seems to be a bunch of Toyotas do this. The front half of the hood gets all chipped up. And they're not stone chips. At least I don't think they are. So he's stripping it. Basically, we're going to take it to bare metal. Off. It's a whole lot easier to paint. And if anybody has, has ever messed with these Toyotas, this thing's got some age to it. It's like an 07. If we take these off, this little gasket's going to fall apart and you'll never get it back on. So we're going to deal with that. I'm not quite sure how we're going to deal with it, but it's an older car. It's going to look nice. Um, the bumper's been patched up once. We're going to patch it up a little bit more. But uh, coming along good. All right, we got Lucas and Haley. We're 
working on the big Ford here. Uh, coming along nicely. This is Loriana. She's uh, she's pulling lead on this thing there. Uh, this is like the last the last big dent in it. Yeah. All right. Oh, oh we got Malachi and Troy on the uh, baby Falcon here. And yes, we have solid take that front grill and headlights up because that's what I told them to do because we're not going to get into taking this thing all apart but it's going to be a really nice paint job when we're done we got the top all bagged up guys this thing's coming along good Look at this. Them boots are made for a walking. Oh, today they're for sanding. They're for sanding. Look at this. Clifford, they've got your cat sanded up. Wonderful. How's it going? Fun. Good. Hey, why don't we say, Crystal, what is our code? Oh. Ow. There we go. <laughs> 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 yeah, I ain't put it on YouTube yet. All right, cool. Hey, we're gonna get the racer wheel, and real slowly, it'll it'll get that off. Well, we're sanding on the flares now. Yeah, getting them ready. Go along with the Dodge truck. How's it going there? Good, 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 good. good. We got Troy and Malachi. Front bumper sanded. Jonathan working on the hood. This is the one that had all the chips. We had to strip it down to bare metal. He's getting that done. That goes on this car. We got Ethan and Mateo. We got the dents there. Getting them cleared. The top wasn't that bad. The clear was just letting go. So they're uh, getting all the paint stripped off of that clear in the base. Good. Say hi, Mom. Here we go. There we go. And we got Joey down here. Yeah, there he is. He's pulling the front end off of this uh, Hyundai. It's going to get a uh, it's gonna get a new bumper, some splash shields. You find anything else under there messed up? Okay. Got a little bit of damage on the fender. No big deal. And uh, we got Ryan. He's finishing up with the butt bucket here. We'll be painting this next week. Uh, this stencil started delaminating when we pulled it off, so we had to get a couple more. We got some flames taped up on this. We'll be ghosting this in. That'll take place next week. Baby Falcon. It's been all spot primed. It's been wiped down, taped up. Hopefully we'll get her painted next week. Yeah. Paint, mix it up. This is that color for that Dodge truck cap. I'm gonna tell you folks, it was like a candy color. See, it's got dye in it. He just put the hardener in there. Gonna put a little bit of reducer in it. Now we'll get him stirring. We got Ramel working on the project here. Turn that block the other way, the long ways. There you go, like that. And do it on an angle. Yep, there you go. This tailgate ended up being a mess. It, it, it'd been painted several times. It was originally a black or dark color, and the paint was blistering off of it. Had a bunch of little, had a bunch of ripples in it. It ain't gonna be perfect, but it's gonna be a whole lot better than it was. Come on, let's give us that smile, smile, Ramel. There we go. All right. The other day, the girls that were working on that Dodge 
top. They mix up the base. We keep talking about the candy. The candy's in the cup right now. I'm calling it the candy, the mid-stage. Now paint's getting ready to put, it only calls for one coat of this. We're gonna put that on, then we're gonna shoot regular clear on top of it. All right, take it away. <laughs> 